Welcome back. The Kentucky Department of Agriculture is currently working to develop two new programs with the goal of getting and keeping Kentucky veterans and farmers on the job. Agriculture Commissioner James James Comer, <coughs> excuse me, and Mike Lewis of Gaining Grounds Farm are joining us now with a look ahead at the Home Grown by Heroes program as well as the Kentucky Proud Jobs for Vets program. Two things you're very excited about, Commissioner. Tell us how these came to be. Well, we're very <coughs> excited. You know, we're a very pro-military state in Kentucky. We have two huge military bases here. We also have a lot of National Guard units around the state. Uh, it, it's become apparent that the unemployment rate for our veterans is higher than the average for the rest of the state, and that's unfortunate. So we wanted to do something to help uh, try to provide opportunities for our veteran farmers, either through employment or through their own farming operations. And Mike, tell us something about your background and, and how you hope veterans will benefit from this. Uh, I've been farming in Kentucky for seven years now. Uh, kind of took a little bit of time off last year from farming a little more to help develop some markets in the area. Um, and uh, I, I believe that this program is obviously it's going to help veterans with uh, distinguishing their product at the point of sale. But I think the important piece of that is it allows them to tell a story. And uh, that that story isn't just that they're veterans and they've served, that it's they've found another way to serve their, their yeah. country. And it's in helping build communities and support our communities with mm -hmm. And also there's the Homegrown by Heroes mm -hmm. program. Talk about that a little bit. That's going to be a special part of the Kentucky Proud program. There will be a logo that I, that is distinguishes itself from a regular Kentucky Proud logo. It will say Homegrown by Heroes Kentucky Proud. So that's to be able to identify the consumer that this is a Kentucky Proud product that was produced or manufactured by a veteran farmer. So I think a lot of the consumers want to go out and show their appreciation to our military veterans for their service and they'll want to pick that product out off the shelf or at the restaurant because it helps a veteran and they everyone appreciates the sacrifices that our veterans uh, have, have made for our country to make it a better place. And Mike, how does farming resonate with the veteran population? Uh, it's, it's about service. I, I think a lot of our veterans that are coming home right now are, are being are coming out of the service not out of choice but through disabilities uh, with a huge number of traumatic sure. brain injuries and they're still looking for a way to serve it that service is ingrained in them and and what better way to serve than to help build communities and feed people we thank you for your service and we thank you for all that you're doing to keep us all um eating well and, and all of those things in the state as well and we want to let everyone know in the coming days there will be a website up and mm -hmm. running about all of this information right. and what we can do as consumers to kind of support things commissioner well, we're excited and we're excited for our veteran population and hopefully this will make a big difference. Well, that sounds like a great program. Thanks for coming. Appreciate Thank you. it very, very much.